Hey guys, Daryl here from Show TV. Just got a quick unboxing video for you for our fabulous Zippy Juicer. Let me show you what you get inside. So it comes in a nice box like this, and uh, you just undo the tabs there, open it up. And the first thing you're going to see inside is the recipe book. Okay, so it's great to have a juicer, but it's also nice to have fabulous recipes to get you going. And this one here is a great recipe book. So let me show you quickly some of the ones that you have inside here. Um, so you've got your Jolly Green Giant, uh, the Detoxifier. So that's a juice that I do in one of our demonstration videos. So you can check that out on our website or on some of our social pages. Um, the list goes on and on. You've got lots that involve carrots in here, um, almond milk and cashew milk. And then right at the back, you also have a sorbet and um, a carrot ginger soup as well. So get into that recipe book. That gets you going. And uh, then you can start making your own creations from there. Now it has a set of instructions in there as well. So that's to show you how to assemble the juicer, how to get the best use out of the juicer as well. And then a uh, nice big toothbrush, just kidding. <laughs> so this one's for cleaning the juicer. Um, this is specifically designed to get into some of those hard to reach places. I will say though, over many, many years being in this business, I've seen a lot of juices. This one is very easy to clean. Uh, then you've got your USB charger lead. Now folks, this just plugs into the base of the juicer and into a USB charger port. Okay, so most of you will have a uh, USB port at home. For example, I use my iPhone charger. Um, please bear in mind that it needs to have a five volt output. Okay, so most of these USB chargers have a five volt output, but you can see it written on the side. If you've got an iPhone, um, then you should be good to go there. So there's your charger lead. And then the juicer itself comes nicely wrapped here in this packaging. So we'll just pop the box over here for now. And um, let's have a little look. Right, so first thing we're gonna pull out here, this is your base. So inside the base, it has a very powerful lithium ion battery. Uh, the battery is actually 60 watts, okay? So the motor pack's in there and you've got your on and off switch on the side. And then you'll also see that's where your charging lead goes in on the side there. Uh, next in line, we have the main body of the unit. Now, if you've watched the demonstration video, uh, you'll be familiar with the fact that this is actually a slow juicer. So you get that lovely cold pressed juice. And uh, in there, you've got your catch cup. So this one here is for catching the pulp that comes out the side. Uh, you've got the um, pressy thingy <laughs> that goes on the top there for pressing the um, fruit and veg in. Uh, this is the main chute. And then you also have in here, this is what we call the screw, okay? So that actually turns around and, and um, screws the fruit and veg in and cold presses it. And then this is the sieve piece. And then finally, this is, um, I guess, the tank. So a few little tips, just so you know, when you get it home to assemble it, you have the main body of the unit, and then you've got the tank. Now, if you look on the tank here, you'll actually see it has an activator rod, okay? That activator rod goes down into this part here, which is called a micro switch. Now, this is a safety feature. This is so when you, so basically the juicer will only work when it's assembled correctly. So basically, have a little look here. You've got a, a, a square piece cut out on the side. So you line up the square piece with the square piece, push it down, and then that, locks in nice and tight in place, okay? Uh, next bit is the screw goes into the sieve there, and that clips on top. Now, you'll see you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 little prongs. So that piece goes over those 10 prongs and pushes in like so. And then all you do is clip the chute on top. So that clips on like that. Now, did you hear that beep? When I push that down, Hear that? So now you know the juice has been assembled correctly. As soon as you hear that beep, you're good to go. And then you've got the uh, chute goes in the top there, your pulp. That's it, we're ready to juice. 
So all we do now, of course, is uh, grab your ingredients, turn it on, throw them in the chute, and out this side you're going to get the pulp, and out this side here you're going to get your juice. So you've got your little trap door there, so you can either build the juice up in the unit, or open that up and the juice will come out directly into the cup or container. That's basically it, so thanks for watching.